Hey guys, so I'm about to dive into a new show and this one has been on my radar for a good long while. I did a poll on my Patreon between this and Death Note and a lot of people preferred Death Note. So um, I dived into that series and you can catch it now on my channel or on my Patreon. But Tokyo Ghoul has always been on my radar and a show I definitely wanted to check out. I hear it's amazing. So I've got the box set of the manga and I can't wait to dive into it plus the sequel, Tokyo Ghoul Re. So I'm um, really looking forward to diving into those and, and having a read once I'm finished with, with the with the anime. Now, I know Season 1 is beloved, but a lot of people don't like Season 2. There is a Season 3 as well, I think, so I'd really appreciate you guys to let me know down below if I should do like the, the three seasons of this show or just stick to the anime for Season 1. But what do I know going in? Not much. I just know it's about ghouls in Tokyo monsters and stuff and a bit of mayhem so um i'm really excited to dive in and watch it blind so this will be a completely blind reaction i'm not going to know anything going in uh no manga reading at this point like i said and i've never seen the show before so i don't know anything about the characters or the plot or, or the or the anything blind like i said it's going to be a complete first time watch so the way i do things here on my channel if this is your first time coming along if tokyo ghoul has brought you in i do a timer based reaction where i don't show any of the the footage of the show or the audio i just have the the timer based reaction with the the bottom portion of the show only so you can read along with the subtitles and watch it with your own copy so um yeah copyright and all that stuff i don't want to breach it and have my my channel struck down because i've breached any laws that are, are pretty important so i take it quite seriously so watch along with your own copy if you don't like it then you can move on to other channels that do do it but um like i said they kind of do it at their own peril but you know to each their own so without further ado let's just dive into tokyo ghoul episode number one tragedy i'm hoping i, I love this I'm, I'm sure i will because I, I like my horror and everything so this should be fun okay three two one go tokyo ghoul finally i've been wanting to watch this for so long Straight away, the animation is quite striking. So it's about, is, it, is it about vampires? Please don't spoil. That's a dead person. So they're calling them ghouls. Oh, shit. Definitely flesh eaters. Oh, God, she's got accessories. A binge eat arm. Okay. So this is going to be nice and gory. I like the score. Orders from above. Shit. Nice, the animation is gorgeous. Oh, she took some things. Wow, this is epic looking. Turkey Like I said, I didn't know what to go, I didn't know what to expect going in, but it's very pretty. Like the animation is, is gorgeous, like the use of colors. Some male bodies. So ghouls, so ghouls are a known thing. Ghouls are a known thing. Too, too, too big girl. So this is going to be our, like our, our main dude. Oh, 
Hyde, that's his name. Predatory ghoul attacks. So they're like vampires, right? Or just demons? Oh, is that those names hide? Okay. So forward, dude. You embarrassed the poor girl. She's the one. Is she a ghoul? Is she gonna bite him? She's walking in slow-mo. She's a hottie. <laughs> okay, what's what's his name then? Kaneki. Kaneki. Grace. Grace thing. Yeah, with the singing Travolta. I'm I'm sorry. Off track. I do that sometimes. Welcome to my reactions. Egg of the Black Goat. So she likes reading cookbooks? Goats don't lay eggs. Is she evil? She is succubus. Ah, oh, they're reading the same book. Okay. Okay. So a binge eater is a bad thing. Bonding over books, so cool. Don't choke. Oh. <laughs> Miss Rise. Yeah, she sure is. Did you not notice? She's not eating much. Time to bite you, I'm a monster. Walk me home. Oh, it's a trap. Oh, pretty. I like when they do that with trees, put all the, the fairy lights in there, it's nice.
down the dark alley? Are you the ghoul? Or is she like a ghoul hunter? I'm digging it so far. And I'm very hungry. Oh, she's, she, she did say she's on a dietary regime. That's why she wasn't eating much of the regular food. She likes... She likes humans. Oh, she's gonna change. Uh-oh. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's not your lucky day. Well fuck. Oh! I was I was right. <laughs> she a vamp. Is she the one from the beginning? Is she the binge eater? Oh, <laughs> oh my god. No. What the fuck? What is... She likes the thrill of the chase. What? Is she Doc Ock? This is sick. Kaneki san. I like the look of the the ghoul here. With all the tentacles. She's um Oh, she's impaling him. She's just playing with her food. This date has ended badly. Why? Was that the chick who walked past? Did she do this? Is she dead? He's still alive though, he's gonna change. Oh, this is very good. You were, and then she started to eat you. Not in the nice way. I'm sorry. Next of King, he's dying on the table. Wow, the imagery is amazing. Holy shit. Transfer her organs into him. Is that her? The transformation is starting. Is he... Oh, yeah, he's... Oh! Fucking Terminator! <laughs> is he alive? Oh, I don't like food anymore. He lives. But... The transformation will begin. This is like, um... An American werewolf in London. He survives the attack, goes to hospital, meets a nice nurse, and then slowly changes and has nightmares and shit. Dr. Canoe. There's Rise. Nope, not hungry. He's getting another appetite. Oh god, he's got the COVID. A 
so if they if the world knows about ghouls right i'm assuming ghouls are a known commodity in this world wouldn't they know the symptoms and what happens to you if you're attacked by a ghoul and live when they just go shit this guy's gonna he's gonna change lock him up or cut his head off or something or they just didn't realize that um he was attacked by a ghoul and just assumed all those girders fell on him and fucked him up. I'm very impressed with the animation. So he's... He's going to kill his best friend. He's going to kill Hyde. Nope. It tastes icky. Dead, dead tongues. Oh. That's right, buddy. Yeah, fucked. He's gonna try. Delicious thing in a bag. What is that? A hamburger? In a bag? I want a hamburger now. Yep. Now it tastes like ass. Icky yuck. Uh oh. I'm sorry, but the food in Japan seems weird. Like the stuff in the bag, I mean, that you hit off. Oh, he, it tastes like shit. He's starting to realize. I would be, I would be bummed too, man. If you suddenly couldn't enjoy food anymore because you're turning into a creepy monster that wants to eat people, that would suck. Best friends, huh? Who's that mysterious person? So is Miss Rise dead now? Or is she gonna come back and um start to tutor him in the ways of the dark side? Oh, I think my tummy's doing that as well. Apologies. I am hungry. Oh, they smell good. Don't, no. Don't eat the children. No, no, no. Man flesh. Flesh, flesh, flesh. Run away, little girl. Oh. He's freaking out. What? It's a ghoul eye? Oh, well, he can still see his reflection in a mirror, so he's not a vampire. Transfer whose organs into him?
Don't don't check. Is he gonna check? Don't check. Wait, what? Did the knife break? Is he invulnerable now? The weapons of man can no longer kill him. No weapon forged. I watch a lot of horror, I tell you. A lot of lore out there to, in to investigate. He seems like a, a sweet, innocent kid. But that can be what? Brings in his victims. Oh no. It's not your mum's home cooking. It's gonna be it's gonna be it's gonna be your friend? Oh he's It's somebody's home. Oh this is good, I'm loving this. This is so cool. No. Oh, 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 oh. Is that another goal? Oh, Oh, he's smelling the fresh meat. I like how he's only half and half at the moment. It's kinda, first day. No, I'm hungry. That's the dude with the glasses. So that's not normal. Stern talking to? That would be unbelievable. It's his first day, come on. Oh, the passerby. Nishiki. Toka. I'm trying to learn the names, I'm terrible at it. So the binge, so she is dead. And Teku? They're gonna... They're gonna brawl. Oh shit. She quick. Take take your food with you. <laughs> so he's only got one eye in ghoul form. If he eats, will he go full ghoul? I was just looking at the cover of the manga box. I shouldn't cheat. Oh, we're coming to the end? Only one of your eyes, that's a thing. Yes, she recognizes him. He survived the attack. And yet not. Dive in. So if he eats, he'll go, he'll turn.
yet. So is this going to be the series, his battle? Yeah, <laughs> literally. Oh! Force feeding him. Yamo. Cool. That was very good. They got a lot of um English names in the cast list, so obviously I'm not watching the uh, the dub. I often like to check out the sub first. And if I really, really like a show, I'll end up buying it on Blu-ray as well and watch it again, often in the the dub format, just to mix it up. The animation is striking. I can't wait to read the manga. Great use of color. The song's cool. That is an amazing image. I've been so excited to watch this show for so long. Finally here. But if you're familiar with my other anime reactions, you know that one, I'm terrible with um, the name pronunciation. Get used to that. And two, two, <laughs> remembering all the names as well. So my plan is to watch an episode of this every day. I'm currently on two weeks annual leave. So there's only 12 episodes in season one. So I'm just going to like do one every day. So I have it in the can ready to edit and upload. But yeah, my question is, do I, do I dive into season two as well? So this is the guy. Oh wow. Had his head kicked off. That was very reminiscent to Mob Psycho. Okay, so we had um a very synopsis of that poor guy, what he was doing, how his life was, and then one day wrong place, wrong time, and he gets his head kicked off by another dude. Okay. Um, let me just go to my notes. I just want to have a look and make sure I've got everything covered. Tokyo Ghoul episode number one. Uh, Tragedy episode two coming up next week. Incubation. So I just like to have a, a brief synopsis uh, and make sure I'm not wrong. Oh, this is going to end in a second. I've got to pause the video and then come back. Okay, my camera can only record for 30 minutes and then it stops. So I'm just going to pause it. There's going to be a brief edit. Okay, ready? Okay, I'm back. How you doing? That was... It's really quick. Amazing editing skills, wasn't it? Uh, that's what I do. Okay. Um, okay, so the, snop the synopsis is, amid news reports of ghoul attacks nearby, ordinary college student Ken Kaneki encounters Rise, a girl who is an avid reader like him, at the cafe, at the cafe that he frequents. Eh, forgive me, I can't talk. Little does he realize that his fate will change overnight. So getting to know all the characters, we just met that one who... who who walked past, the, the day he was walking down the alley with Rise, she walked past and spotted them, but just continued on. So she's the, one, she's the one that came back and essentially saved his life from being eaten by glasses, dude. So now he's changing. So as I suspected, in these kind of shows, you get the, the hapless victim who gets attacked by the monster, and then they slowly transform and change into that very thing, and it's their battle. So I'm imagining that the girl, and I'll get a name eventually, but she's going to kind of take him under her wing, and introduce him to the world of the, the Tokyo ghouls and kind of teach him. Like, she just force-fed him there. So he was kind of resistant. He didn't want to eat the corpse. A lot of us don't want to. I mean, it's kind of gross. But she she hand-fed him. I don't know if that's literal or a pun. But she shoved something into his mouth and it kind of ended just as um as that re the repercussions of getting blood into his mouth kicked in. So I can imagine he's going to go ravenous and just chow down and have a good time, you know, a hearty meal. So most of the ghouls can eat one person, and then and that will sustain them for a month. So Rise was a binge eater, so she kind of like took over the territory and was um a real pain in the ass for all the other ghouls. But now that she's gone, the the other ghouls can step up and maybe and maybe there'll be like a population problem now. The the ghouls are going to go rampant. 
rather than having one just binge eat, there's going to be like hundreds of them. And of course, there's going to be the politics of the girls themselves. I mean, I don't think they take kindly to the new recruits. Maybe the, the victims who get bitten by a ghoul and transform are, are frowned upon. Maybe they like you know the, the full fully fledged birth ghouls who are born into the family, so to speak. Maybe that's why he's only got one eye because he was turned, which might be pretty unusual. Because I'm thinking most victims that get attacked by the ghouls don't usually live. I mean, their, their food, they get devoured, they don't come back. So he's, he lived, which seemed to be a surprise to to the one, the girl at the end, who, who said, she actually said that you were with Rise that night. How are you alive? Well, words to, the, to that effect. So maybe it is unusual. Ooh, I like it. This is good. So I'm going to, like I said, do one a day and hopefully get this show all up to you and um, and we have fun watching it together. But oh uh, yeah, good, good first step. Liked it. I'm in. Let's do it. Anyway, catch you next week. Thanks for watching.